The difference between depressions and anticyclones. A depression is an area of low atmospheric pressure. They are associated with many different types of weather. Depressions bring cloudy, rainy and stormy weather with high winds. This is because the low pressure is caused by rising air which takes with it moisture from the surface. This moisture then condenses and forms clouds and rain. The low pressure system is very small and compact, usually only a few hundred kilometers across, meaning that there is usually a high pressure gradient leading to strong winds. The UK experiences 60 to 80 depressions a year and it accounts for the wet and windy weather that is stereotypical here. An anticyclone is an area of high atmospheric pressure. They are associated with clear skies, sun in the summer, frost in the winter and fog, mist and smog all year round. The high pressure is caused by the sinking of air and so any moisture in the upper troposphere is brought down to the surface, hence no clouds. These systems can be very large, around 25,000 kilometers across, and can block depressions coming into the area, causing a hard frost or heat wave. Due to its large size the pressure gradient is very shallow so a gentle breeze is the most that occurs in a high pressure system. Hazard associated with low pressure systems are stormy windy weather such as the Great Storm of 1987 which caused 2 billion pounds of damages and killed 20 people. High pressure systems cause icy, foggy conditions that can affect driving conditions and also trap pollutants near the surface, such as the P supers of Victorian London in which many breathing related deaths would occur. Thanks for watching. By Sam Squires.